When we first moved in, we were definitely overwhelmed. We were moving into this farmhouse with 16 feral cats on the property. The realtor said they don't really think they can catch the cats. Is it going to be a deal breaker? And I said, no. Oh my God. Look at them all. I wanted to just start spending a lot of time with them. So I would start just hanging out in my driveway. I would sit out there and I would throw treats for them. Hi, Dusty. Over time, I kind of started adding stuff. I would get some catnip or maybe I'd bring out some toys. Every night I would come home from work and the cats would be in the driveway waiting for me. We were able to fix all 16. And they've all been vaccinated. <laughs> the previous owners were feeding them out in this shed that was not the greatest. It was missing doors and windows, so it wasn't protecting them from the elements. The cats really didn't have any shelter to be safe in. So from there, our thought process was, these cats need better shelter. We have an outdoor storage room. It wasn't anything that we were really using, so I was like, you know what? Maybe we should create a cat room for these cats. It just slowly snowballed from there. Okay, so these are my ideas for when we go shopping. I think we need to get a variety of cat bed sizes. We should definitely get two of these houses. Multiple escape routes, multiple uses, warm, heated. Yep, let's do it. All right, we'll definitely need some of these beds. Some bowls. Some food bins. I think that's the one. Let's get it. Definitely gonna need a lot of these. There was no real power out there, so we ran some electric so that we could get some actual heat in there for them. We decided to make a little catwalk for them. Why is she perfect? I love her. We built higher up shelves where they can get real up high. So the heated houses finally came in, and the cats are already loving them. So got plenty of beds up here. We got new bowls for them. We got the cat tree. Of course, the catwalk. Another cat tree and nice big beds for them to cuddle in. They absolutely love the cat room. It's been an amazing journey. It's just the best feeling and they just seem so happy and that just makes us so happy. When we first moved in, we were definitely overwhelmed by them. Now we look at them as part of our family. I can't even imagine going outside and not seeing all my cats there anymore. I remember when I would go out there to feed them and they would scatter, they would run, they were so skittish. And now I come home and they'll come up to me and they want some sort of attention. I'm like, I forgot those are even feral cats. I think the best part is just having that unconditional love that the cats have given us. It taught me a lot about just loving animals in the way that they, they deserve. They, they deserve want. and they want to be loved. We're going to be doing a remodel on our house, hopefully this summer. And that means the cat room's going to be getting quite a big upgrade. I really want to do little house cubbies for each of the cats. And I want more catwalk systems than just bridges and all kinds of cool tunnels and things like that for them. Yeah, just give them any cat street to hang out in that cat room. Right. <laughs>